relative coordinates. Relative coordinates you can think as the previous point as a temporary origin. So we're going to say from whatever that last spot was, we are now going to go at a certain distance and up a certain distance. So let's draw a uh, Let's draw a line, we'll pick on the line command. And we'll start the line command, let's say at one comma one. So I'll type in one comma one, and I'll hit enter. You can see I'm at one comma one. Remember that these little grid lines are at half, at a half. So it's over one grid, over two, that's one, and up one half and up to one. Now, I want to type in, whenever it's a relative, I want to type in an at symbol. That's above the number two. Once I have the at symbol in, I can say I want to go over two units in the positive x. So I'll type in two, and I'll hit a comma, and I want to go up positive two units in the y. And I'll type in two, and I'll hit enter. And now that drew that line segment, I'm going to hit enter to finish the line command. So I started at 1 comma 1, remember this is a half, this is 1, and then I went over 2 units, so there's a half, there's 1, 1 and a half, 2, and I went up 2 units, here's half, here's 1, here's 1 and a half, here's 2. So what the relative coordinates say is from wherever we were, right, we're going to go in, in we're going to go over a distance in a direction from wherever we were. So, um, oh, let's get rid of this. I'll do one more. So I'm going to come up here and start a line. This time I'll start from 0, comma 0. And I'm going to say I want to go at, which is above the number 2. And now I want to say, hey, from that location, I want to go over 3 units, comma 2. So I went 3 units to the right in the x and up two units okay so it doesn't matter re really where I'm at I can just pick a spot at random I don't even know where that spot is but I could say hey I want to go at and I want to go over three units comma two so in this case I went and I'm going to enter from this particular spot wherever I was at I went over three units to the right and up two units so the the relative coordinates uses the at symbol to say from that previous spot we're going to use it as a temporary spot then we're going to measure so relative coordinates